Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel and what an absolutely lovely day. Hello mate, what are you doing? Uh, who are you? I'm Astro Bloke. I wondered if you wanted to do a collaboration with me. Okay, this has turned really weird. I was thinking we could do something like M51, you know, the Whirlpool Galaxy. Listen mate, I'm an Astro Bloke. Whatever, I've got this CT10 scope. It's 1200 millimetres focal length. It'll frame it up beautiful. Well, I suppose so. I've got the same scope after all. Excellent. That's really good. This will be a great collab, if you say so. My name's, My name's Glenn, 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 and you're watching Astro Bloke. Chill out, mate. Hi everyone, I hope you're all keeping well. I'd like to start off by apologising for not releasing many videos of late. Unfortunately, some personal circumstances have kept me away from the camera, but uh, they're all sorted now, and I'm gonna be back in front of the camera a bit more, so you're gonna be seeing more of me, but only one, I promise. I think uh, two is too many. Um, I've been uh, carrying on with my astrophotography and I've got a nice uh, collection of images to share with you so hopefully you'll enjoy those uh, projects that I've been on so make sure you've subscribed and click the bell notification so that you get notified of when my next video comes up. This video is on the M51 Whirlpool Galaxy Here's an image here that I took last year with my RC8 and uh, I was really happy with this image. It was a really nice uh, target to photograph um, and I'd avoided it for some time for some reason. And uh, I'm really happy with this image but I actually do feel that I've improved on it quite a bit so I'm really pleased at that. My new CT10 scope is amazing, it resolves images so nicely and I use my 294mm and my 2600mm and they're the two cameras I use with this to make a kind of uh, a solo collaboration if you like and the only reason that happened was because I didn't have the 2600 working because I had no filters so I'd started it with the 294 and then I took some 2600 and I just thought I'll put the data together. The Whirlpool Galaxy, also known as Messier 51, is a grand design galaxy. It's interacting with a dwarf galaxy of uh, NGC 5195 nearby. It's 31 million light years away from Earth and is 400 million light years across. And it's said to have 100 billion stars in there. I mean, these numbers when we say them on these uh, uh, videos, they don't sound a lot, you know, they, they just sort of say them off the cuff, but they are huge. And when you actually sit down, put these things on paper, or actually have a proper look at it, you realize just how vast everything is up in that universe. And re we realize how small and insignificant we really are. So before I share the image with you, I just want to say a huge thank you to everyone for your support in the channel and for your comments. I really do enjoy responding to you all. Extra thanks to my channel members. That extra support you give me really does help a lot. I've had a few people contact me uh, asking if I had a Patreon account and I didn't have one, but I have actually just set one up. I'll put a link in the description below because I think some of you want to support me in that way. So I've added that to my channel too. But thank you ever so much. It really do appreciate all of your support and I hope you enjoy the final image that I'm about to show you of the Whirlpool Galaxy. And until next time, please take care and I wish you all clear skies.